Uh, I reckon I could survive on an island for a lot longer than I ever would have been able to, thanks to just getting fat. <laughs> Sucks. So, uh, <laughs> whatever. Good Goodwill Hunter sent me a big box of stuff and I made a video opening it and I was bored watching it myself. And I'm pretty narcissistic, so if I'm not, if I can't enjoy watching a video that I made myself, then you know. Anyway, I jest, or do I? Uh, anyway, already getting bored. So he sent me all this stuff. He's been like putting crap in a box for like three years or something. I have no idea. It's been a long time, and I love it. It's just just for fun, something to do. Like we're, he's one of my really good friends on YouTube from way back in the day, and uh, so. That Weezer thing I showed you and this shirt and the other shirt that I had on, plus the tape that was playing. Just random stuff in a box he sent me. Some that I asked for, mostly random stuff. So I'll quickly show you the tapes he sent me uh, and a few other things. And then there are 30 some games and then 30 Wii games. And that's like, he sent me a bunch of Wii games a few years back. So I would say that my uh, NTSC Wii collection is more than half it composed of games that he gave me. So yeah thanks man all right so you just heard a selection from this uh, yeah this tape cassette right and I'm just gonna quickly go through them but a lot of these are especially this one spin doctors little miss little miss can't be wrong hey you don't drop it on the floor yeah uh, tapes that I had in high school or in junior high school because we didn't start really using CDs until in my case, like I had one, a CD player, but I didn't use it that much until college. In college, I used it a lot more. I had a few CDs in high school. I'm 44, by the way, I just had my birthday. Happy birthday to me. So this box is almost like a birthday box, but I don't think that's what it was meant to be because we've been talking about it for a long time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So uh, I just natural light, I didn't turn the lights on basically because I forgot or whatever. And I won't back down. So, <laughs> and I showed you this one already. I actually really like listening uh, to country music these days. Not that I always agree with what people say. And they, you know, there's a lot of disagreement within the genre. So there's that. But um, because I can understand what they're saying. And part of that's getting older. And I have some, I think I have some kind of like nerve deafness. Because I can't pick out what people are saying. Uh, but I can hear everything. It's just, blah. who cares, right? I'm old, <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I like being able to understand what they say, and that's pretty much the whole reason, actually. Never mind. He also sent me uh, <laughs> Duncan Yo-Yo, the original, world's number one. That's awesome. I will probably open that and play with it. I love yo-yos. I just don't. I haven't done it much, but that's so cool. It's neat to have it in the in the box or whatever. But like, I'll probably open it and play with it. But not right now. Okay. Keep it sealed in the box. He sent me what may be the greatest, well, maybe not the greatest, but this is such a great idea for a plug and play uh, controller. I'll cover up what it is and you can guess what it is. What is this? Check this out. Boing, boing. It has a little wiener, I mean a little um, plunger. It's a, it's a, what is it? It's classic, I can't read, I can't read. Classic, <laughs> classic arcade pinball. I haven't played it yet, but I'm looking forward to doing so, and oh, I will. Uh, I may have best my best, uh, it's gonna work best on a CRT, like it's gonna look better and the input lag will be less, but I have a really good TV, so I'll try it in game mode and see how it does. And what else? I have all those games upstairs to show you because I made the video once, like I said, and it was so bad. Um, all right, so, I don't know if you can see this red mark, I was making gyoza. <laughs> the oil got hot and like a little piece of gyo gyoza is um, pot stickers or Chinese dumplings. And a little piece of gyoza skin just jumped out of the hot oil and, and stuck. Ow, that hurt actually right now. It's stuck on my forehead. I think that happened two days ago. So now I have this like red burn on my forehead. Awesome. Also, two herniated discs. So that's good. So I could barely move. I mean, I could move. But anyway, I was in a lot of pain for... About two weeks, I got a brocochusha, which is, I don't know if it's cortisone or what, but a shot in my back to make the pain, like, not, like, less, I can't, to make the pain more bearable, and then I've been taking painkillers and putting a pad on my back that, like, 
directly puts more pain and more more drugs drugs into my back but the last few days has been a lot better so for a while we thought i might need surgery and that would have sucked um if it flares up again i'll have to go for an mri and see if that's a thing that needs to happen but it's funny that i'm wearing a mega man shirt because i am a mega man like i'm fatter than i've ever been in my whole life and i'm not happy about it but i can't do much exercise yet uh but it's not as hot i'm hoping that i've maxed out and i'm gonna move back the other way because this is kind of ridiculous one reason there's a lot of reasons and i can blame corona as we all have right is my <laughs> my daughter won't let me not skip breakfast and that's the intermittent fasting and that's one of the ways that i have managed to like keep my weight down in the past but uh yeah, it's it's bad. I'm fat. So I also, um, I asked uh, Goodwill Hunter to just check his like local Goodwills and stuff, because he's a Goodwill Hunter, uh, for really, really high quality, nice Bibles, um, because because I wanted them. You can't find them in Japan, and uh, not the nice ones anyway. And I'm just curious about it, interested in the history of them and stuff, and I, I do read it, so... Um, here's two that he found, and I don't know, he found two really great ones. I'll just, I don't think most people on my channel are probably interested in that, but they're both leather and leather liner, and if you're a vegan or whatever, I'm sorry, like, this happened a long time ago, but in any case, buying the used ones means the new ones don't get bought, right? So, <laughs> I can't make everyone happy, and I can't try, and if I try, that's just annoying. Um, but yeah, I was really surprised how nice, especially this brown one was, it even has the, the gold the gilt line on the inside so really high quality stuff um but i want to go get those games and show them to you i was a religion major sorry i should say that something about that i was a religion and philosophy major in university so i read a lot of that kind of stuff maybe that explains it i shouldn't need to explain it but uh i won't back down okay <laughs> but i might flip over i'll be right back with some more exciting stuff or not! Where's the bloody... Oh, there it is. But if you're a cat lover, I should apologize. Because I think the cats are sleeping downstairs and they won't be in this video. In the original one, there were cats. But I filmed it on my Android phone. I got the... I can show it to you, actually, since I'm not using it. Um, what is this? Right now I'm using a clear case. This is the LG V60. Oh, look. Hi! Hey, <laughs> that's freaky. This is the LG V60 ThinkQ, or Think. I don't know how it's supposed to be pronounced. But I bought it because I wanted to do Android for a while, um, but also because this one you can put a case on it that adds a second screen, and the second screen is a touch screen with the same quality, and it also does a touch pen. So it's awesome. I love it, but it's not perfect. I mean, you just have to, they both have their advantages. I miss the mail app on iOS, and just taking videos and editing them is... <laughs> well, I'm used to it. Let's just leave it at that, but I think it is better. Anyway, there are ways around all these things, but I'm too lazy. So here's a bag of toys that were in the box, and I'm going to go through them kind of quickly. There's a bunch of Happy Meal, and I opened them in the video, whatever. Happy Meal Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and I don't know anything about these, but what I think is interesting about these is, so here they are. I want to say this is, I forget, this must be Leonardo. I think Leonardo was a blue. I could be wrong, but Ryan, he's got his, like, surfboard thing or whatever hoverboard i don't know it's a it's a collaboration with back to the future i don't know and here's michelangelo right and then here's like this is i guess donatello because he's purple right but why is he the abominable ninja turtle i don't know i said the cats aren't going to become and then here comes a cat so i have more to say about the ninja turtles what do you want did you want to be in a video yeah come here you don't get a choice you have to pay your rent Hi, it's Crouton. He does not appear often, but Justin, who sent the stuff, likes him, so say hey. What's up? What's up? Meow. He's like, just leave me, let me go. Okay. Please release me, let me go. What's I on about that? Oh, so <laughs> they're Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and they're getting in fights with, like, dudes with, uh, you know, weapons and whatnot. Well, we're gonna, we're gonna rule out the abominable Ninja Turtle, but these two... They're going skateboarding, so they gotta make sure that they put on their helmets. It's okay to have ninja fights with swords and stuff without a helmet, but if you go skateboarding, 
you make sure you have your helmet. And here's your skateboard ramp, I guess, apparently, because it says Mikey on it. So Mikey, there you go. You can mount up. Mikey's mounted up, he's ready to rock. And I can just display this proudly, I don't know, in the Nintendo Jujuba, in the Ninja Turtle oh, Turtles, I don't know, place. <laughs> Uh, and then um, two other little things. These are definitely going to be proudly displayed. I need one of uh, Dew, because I have like the Dew Amiibo and the Dew thing that came with Street Fighter V. But here's Ken, and here is Chun-Li. I'm pretty sure, I could be wrong because I'm wrong a lot, stuff, but whatever these are called, these are kind of cool. Just hanging out, doing their thing. Why don't we just put them right there? Uh, but I need to go fast and do this and be done with it. So I think that was the toys. Oh, and there's like a another like thing, but I don't know <laughs> where to go. Here it is. It's a spy gear decoder carabiner. I don't know. I haven't figured out how to use it yet because I'm not intelligent enough. That's my alarm telling me that I need to go pick up my daughter <laughs> from uh, from preschool. So, I'm going to quickly go through these 30. Ooh, the cat just opened the door by himself. Sudden burst of intelligence. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> 30 Wii games and a couple other things. I really got to go fast. This is one of my favorite games on the Game Boy Advance as far as cartridges go. Because it has gyrus on it. And I feel like we must have talked about this, but... I bought this a while back and I even made a video, but my box is all super sun faded and stuff. And he sent me not only a nice box, I think there's a game in here, uh, but also this uh, cover for it. So I was, I don't remember what he was gonna say because it's been so long, we've been talking about it. Really happy to see that. Got a NES game. This is one that I had wanted when I was a kid and I never got it because you know, you're a kid, you can only buy so many. Fester's Quest! And a 3DS game, which I believe was a launch title. I still play my 3DS fairly often, considering. Here's a bunch of stickers. They might even get stuck. Just gotta figure out where to stick them. Here is my first ever Philips CDI game. And it's a doozy. Woo! Battleship. You sunk my battleship! I need to get a CDI just to play this. I actually have a few consoles that I bought just to play one game. Well, now the CDI is going to join that. I don't know if it's ever going to join that. I, I would like to have one, but I want everything. And then I'm just like, I have too much crap. I'm schizophrenic. I'm a schizophrenic collector. I'm changing my channel name to Schizophrenic Collector. No, I'm not. Uh, I'm just going to go really fast through these, okay? And it's not, I don't want to seem like I don't appreciate it or I'm not happy. I'm super stoked. Like I said, half of my Wii collection is now uh, <laughs> games I got from Goodwill Hunter. But um, I don't have a lot to say about most of them because I haven't played them yet. Maybe half, I've played a little bit. But uh, I just don't want this video to go too long. So here we go. It says Value Village $2.42, Epic Mickey. It's good to have a copy of this because I played it. I played the ROM and I have the ROM still on my hacked Wii, so. Just kidding, I was just kidding. I don't have a hacked Wii with ROM. Uh -huh. I'm curious to play this on the Wii, like the Wii version, just to see how it compares. Especially some of the more gruesome stuff. Victorious, sorry about all the glare, that's nuts. Uh, Boxers Revolution. WarioWare Smooth Moves, I love these mini games. And I'm gonna enjoy that. Another value, value village, two dollars and two cents. Excite Truck! This is one of the really good racing games that you can Play on the Wii. Battalion Wars 2. I'm sweating. Mega Man, sorry about that. Monster Hunter Try. I almost said Try 3. That would have been redundant. And <laughs> I'm lazy and I'm in a hurry. I was actually going to make a, a small video of maybe I will still do that. I don't know. Domino Rally. This is Domino Rally and I want to take all the Domino... No, I want to take all the Wii games and like line them up and play dominoes with them. But I wonder if this is like the Mr. Domino game or whatever it was that, mm, though, Metal Gear 
Jesus, solid, snake. What? Metal. Metal Jesus rocks. <laughs> uh, had on his recent PS1 Hidden Gems video. Because that looked kind of interesting. Anyway, maybe some dominoes in the future. And maybe Emma will appear at the end of this. Because now I'm on iOS, so I know how to edit the videos a little bit. And I might toss her in at the end. Just like be like, ah! And she'll just fly across the screen. Need for speed carbon. Rampage. Total destruction. One of the things I like about Grub Gun videos, when he does these kind of videos, is he does, uh, he'll read the back of the game and then make you think, oh, I wonder what game that is. There's only one way to get your hands on a PB1 flamethrower. You gotta earn it. That one is Alien Syndrome. <laughs> okay? I'm sure other people do that too, but he just comes to mind, you know. <clears throat> Escape to Paradise! We Sports Resort. Racing! Redefined! Excite Bots Trick Racing. And I misread it the first time I, and I called it Truck Racing. That was dumb. But uh, yeah, both of the Excite ones are really good, I'm pretty sure. This is Fast Paced Action Hunting. Deer drive. Now I wonder if it's called deer drive because you're road hunting and you're just shooting out of the car because that was what my godfather used to do. He's gone now. We miss him too. He was awesome. He was paralyzed in a car accident, but then he, well, he was supposed to be paralyzed, but he somehow was able to walk anyway. And, um, but you know, he was very kind of slow and his hands are kind of like this. I don't know how to explain it, but he was such an awesome guy and a ladies man. Hello. But when we would go hunting, you're kind of supposed to get out of the car. But he would just like... And uh, of course, he never killed anything. I can't... Like I said, I can't please him. This is just memories. I'm not saying that I did it. It's a thing he did. But, uh... I mean, the, the guy was lucky to be alive. Conduit 2 Limited Edition. It even has... Yeah, this is really nice. That's cool. And it's got the manual... In the landscape orientation. Sorry, it says shake it. <laughs> Treasure yours for the shaking. I'm not gonna win. Uncover the secrets of the Templars. Does it work on this side? Yeah. What time is it? Oh, I'm still, well, I'm still okay. Uh, this is one of the games on my shortlist for the Wii. Um, I think I still need Deadly Creatures, and that's maybe the end of my shortlist. This is a puzzling adventure. Was happy to find this in the box. Yes, I was. It's a heckin' wiki quest for Barbaros treasure. I don't care. <laughs> Some of those games you play it and you're like, wait, this is way more fun than I thought it would be. Hack and slash and def no, hack slash and defeat your rival with your Wii remote. Zampaku. Toe. Uh, I'm not a weeb. I just live in Japan. I think there's a difference. I don't know. Maybe I'm a weeb. Protect or destroy? You make the call. EA Sport. Oh no, it's Activision. Sorry. <laughs> uh, launch a color revolution. It's a rainbow of fruit flavor. The blob. And uh, test your reflexes in the biggest shooter of all time. What could that be, my friends? What could that be? I just finished playing through this again on the PlayStation 4. And I suck at games now, I guess, because I, it was harder <laughs> than I remember it being, but I did finish it. Um, Mario and Sonic compete for the gold. I wonder what that might be. It's Mahjong. So what are you buying? What game is that? Come on, come on, come on. The Nightmare is Reborn. Again. For the however many times. Would you believe I didn't have this game? I, of course I have the Japanese game. I feel like he sent me this one last time in his big box of Wii games. It's like a triannual thing, I guess. But I think last time it didn't have a manual. This time it does have a manual. Yay! Got the manual. Mushroom Men. Mushroom man. Okay. I might have this sealed. 
So now I don't have to open that one. That's going to be a heavy hitter in the future. Oh, yeah. Another one of these. I'm glad he sent me these because these are like the last thing that I would buy. But I'm, I'm in the future. At some point, I'll be really glad that I have them. Make them dead again. Dead again. House of the Dead 2 and 3. Return. I seem to recall people being surprised that that was as, like, uh, mature as it was, even though it was on the Wii. This is a game my wife played on the PS3 quite a bit. I don't think she finished it. She's as bad as I am for not finishing games, but then again, she's platinum more games than I have, so never mind. Um, yeah, there's nothing on the back. Well, it says, it says, let the wild rumpus start. <laughs> Let's let the wild rumpus start, where the wild things are. This was apparently two dollars and two cents of Valley Village. Where is the Valley Village in Japan? That's what I want to know. Last but not least, and I apologize if I'm leaving anything out because this is my second attempt at showing what was in the box. And I'm apologizing to Justin and no one else. You guys can just eat Doritos. Um, I got Nintendo Power times two. This is volume 33. No, no, no. 23 and 33. Pretty excited. Pretty excited to have those. That's nice. And they're even like properly packaged. I don't know what the deal is there. Maybe he had doubles, but I have a nice little, like not massive, but a nice little Nintendo Power collection considering I live in Japan. But I know a guy who has almost all of them. And I agreed to send him one of mine that wasn't a double to help him almost finish his collection. But now I'm like, oh man, I don't know. I shouldn't do it. In fact, it's right there. I made a video about it because I'm like, I'm going to send it to the guy so I'll just make a video looking at every page of the Nintendo Power. So I won't go back on my word. I said I would send it. But uh, I think that's everything. And I don't think there was anything else I needed to talk about. And I do need to go get my daughter. Uh, but let's see. Oh, no. That wasn't everything. There was more. Oh, yes, there was more. It's right behind you. Or behind, yeah. <laughs> Very little things. But just a couple little, I think these are, maybe this is Burger King? I don't know. Little toys that I can give to my daughter. Right? Kind of a block thing there. And then here's a penguin. And what's up with the penguin? He's like, doop a doop a doop. Oh, man, I think I ate too much. And he's like, what? Oh, that, that was anticlimactic. It went better the first time. Let's try it from this side. Here's the penguin. Doop a doop a doop a doop. Oh man, I ate too much. Oh, yeah, it still wasn't that good. Anywho, it's a puking penguin. Or maybe it's just a penguin with a big old fish in his gut. In any case, I think that's all. I think that's all. And I even made a list because I didn't want to go on and 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 on. And on and on and on. Okay, so Domino's and my daughter or not? I guess we'll find out. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Okay, Emma, I have some little toys for you. These are from Justin. Can you say thank you, Justin? Thank you, Justin. Okay. Here's the first one. Here you go. What's that? What does it do? Oh. It's a block. Okay. I can't see. Ah, is that a good toy? Yeah. yeah, okay. Do you want your other toy? Yeah. All right, ready? Put that one down, I'll show you the other one. Here it comes. Ready? Yeah. This is from Justin too. Dun, 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 dun. Ah! <laughs> what is it? Uh, penguin. It's a penguin. But look, it has a big fish, right? And it goes with bleh. I Every time I can't do it right, put it in again. Put it in there. Okay, close the mouth, right? I want to make it throw up. Ready? <laughs> it's a puking penguin. It's a puking penguin. Okay. Do you like these toys? Yeah. Emma. Huh? Do you like these toys? Yeah. Yes? Can you say thank you one more time? Thank you. Okay. Do you remember? <laughs> they don't go together. They're two different toys. They're separate. Not the same. Okay. <laughs> okay. Can you say bye? <laughs> did he eat it? He ate, what did he eat? A big fish? Don't don't eat it, okay? You have to say when the when the penguin throws up. Can you do that? No. Try it. Try it. Do it. Make the penguin throw up. 
Make the penguin go bleh. Penguin go hockey dust this show. Make the penguin throw up. Huh? Really? Well, you do. Okay, anyway, we're going bye bye. See you later. Say goodbye. 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 Why is this camera so close? <laughs> what? Papa. Are you saying papa or bye bye? I can't papa. tell. Papa. Bye bye. Beep beep. <laughs> Why are you so weird? Are you done? All done? Okay, I'm turning it off. Thank you.